Our American citizen uh, sustained very, very serious and significant uh, long-standing uh, injuries. The Obama uh, administration so. is expressing its dissatisfaction with an overseas plea deal for a Serbian basketball player who almost killed a U.S. college student in a fight at this upstate New York bar two years ago. The plea deal was announced in Serbia Tuesday. It will net 23-year-old Miladin Kovacevic two years behind bars, not enough to suit the U.S. government. U.S. authorities say Kovacevic repeatedly kicked 24-year-old Brian Steinhauer in the head and chest during the fight, fracturing his skull and giving him a severe brain injury and leaving him in a coma. It is something that we have uh, you know, pressed hard uh, you know, in, with Ser uh, Serbia for, uh, for justice in this case. Uh, we're, we're disappointed in what we perceive to be a relatively light sentence. Kovacevic was charged in the U.S., but then jumped bail and fled to his home country, which refused to turn him back over to U.S. authorities. Although the Serbian government wouldn't send Kovacevic back to the U.S., it did eventually pay the victim's family $900,000 as part of an agreement that called for trying the 23-year-old in Belgrade. Now, however, Steinhauer's parents say they are dissatisfied with the plea deal and want the Serbian government to hand down a longer sentence. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.